How's it going? Here I have a product called Mozit Lens, and what this is is a wide angle macro and fisheye three in one phone lens. Now, I already have opened it, and you will see in here as fisheye lens, macro lens, and a wide angle lens. And this is designed to go on any smartphone, so it doesn't have to be a specific kind. And under here, you will see what the lens were. Now, I did use these and I tested them, and they actually work pretty good. These are the lens cap that you see right there. You can see how wide and lensy. You can see here it says full screen fish eye lens. On the second one, let me take this off, and we will see now we have a smaller one, but this one is for a macro. You can see it's 0.67x wide by 10x macro. You can actually interchange them and put different ones. This is the whole entire lens fitted in here and it clamps right in and you will see that we have a little you know clamp like device here. You simply stretch it out. We're gonna match the lens here from my Nexus and there we have it. Now I'm going to launch the camera here. This monitor is the halfway and you can't see my printer on the right. And at the bottom actually you can't see my heater. You can't see much of my TV. You want to see like maybe 10%. So now I'm going to put this on and find the best spot for it. And you can see how much more we can totally see with this fish islands. That's the beauty about it. But you can see a warp to it. That's kind of what has to happen with fish eye. You won't see it much if you're on a bigger landscape because it'll give you wide. But that's a big difference as you can see. That's what it looks like with the fish eye lens and then taking it off and that's all we see from there. So if your camera's too zoomed in, you want to make you know closer shots or get more selfies inside of the pictures, you can. And there we go. Okay, now something I want to try as well as doing the front facing camera. I'm going to be putting the wide angle on the front. <laughs> see how that does. I don't know if it's meant for that, but we're going to try it anyways. And wow, I feel like I'm so far away. Look at that. It works for the front. Don't mind my dirty room. And I still, I can still see the quality coming out through it. And so remember, this is what it looks like with the fish eye, without the fish eye. But it works for the front facing camera, that is awesome. A lot of people actually don't like fish eye effect. I didn't like it at first either, but once I saw how convenient it is, you're gonna love it. So you see inside my camera display is what we're gonna pay attention to. And now I'm gonna set this up on here. And, and there we go. Look at how much more we can see. Let's take it off again. And look at that. That's how much we get to see on my normal, you know, taking pictures. And if we have fish eye lens with these little fixed lenses, then we could have a really wide angled picture that we can take. And you're still gonna get really good quality. So there you guys have it. This is the Mozi lens. If you've been looking to get some better wide angle or closer shots, these could be it. Like I said, these are universal. So if you want to get one for yourself, it'll be in the description down below. And as always, thank you for joining, and I will see you guys next time. Later.